Yo, what is up, guys? It's your boy Dominic, your son, son here, coming at you guys with a brand new Black Ops 3 video. Make sure to like this shit. Get this to like 20 likes. Yeah, get this. We, I want 20 likes on this shit, and I will upload a part two if I get the chance, to be honest, cuz like shit be really hectic with me. So, I right. in this um video, I'll be explaining to you guys how to always, but most of the most likely, you gotta be good in order for this to work. You gotta be. Tips, I'll be giving you guys tips and tricks on how to always win on free for all because I know triple play is here and everyone want to get their easy wins, bro. Like, I'll be, I'll be playing free for all, all the time, bro. Like, I was freaking the shit out of that game yesterday, bro. I was like 19 or 20. Um, I was ranked level 20 or 19 yesterday. I'm already 41 today. Like, I was grinding the shit out of this game. I also fixed my X button, which was one of the problems. I was, I was not playing really good for these past few days. Like, yeah, so, as you see, I got this beastly free-for-all gameplay, not hardcore, just regular free-for-all gameplay with the Razorback, the freaking rusty-ass Razorback, but it's good, though, I ain't gonna lie, it's really good. Um, yeah, shit is, this shit is godly, like, the Razorback is godly, but that's not what you guys came for this video for. Like, the first tip I wanna give you guys is the spawns, you have to know your spawns in order to win. Like, I know, I know all the Nuketown spawns, like, if you guys wanna see a video on spawns for maps, like, I can give spawns for three maps, okay? I can't do more than that because it, there are a lot of maps on this game. Just tell me down in the comment section down in the video, bro. Most of you guys probably know the spawns for the maps, to be honest. But I know, mo I know most of the spawns for the maps, so it's easy for me to dominate on free for all A second thing is a good class setup. You have to have a good class setup. If you guys want a good class setup, you can go check some of my old videos. Plus, I have some other videos that I can, um... Like I will make future videos with um good um good classes, like for free for all and good classes in general, guys. So yeah, um a third thing, I have to stress this, guys. Good headsets because sound whoring is really important in this game, especially in free for all. If you have really good gaming headsets or like any headset can do, but I preferably use gaming headsets like. I'm actually ordering a new pair of gaming headsets. I already have these ones, but I kind of want new ones too. So I'll have two pairs. Like, you really need some really good quality um, gaming headsets so you can sound whore. So you can, like, sound whore, like, you can understand where um, players are at and all that stuff. You should put, you, you could change your volume to um, higher and all that stuff. So you can be, like, a freaking sound beast. You can hear, like, you can hear everything with fucking sound whoring. Number four. Your specialist. You have to have a good specialist in order for you to do well. Um, my top three specialists for um playing on free for all is the Seraph, the um what's her name Battery, and uh, the, I only use two basically. I don't even use um, um what's her name Sparrow or whatever. The ability I don't really use weapons unless if I'm going to a contract challenge. But uh, you should use the abilities. The Sparrow you should use her Vision Pulse. The um battery you should use her her armor. The ar I forgot what you call it, bro. The the armor, the kinetic armor. Yeah. And for Seraph you should use combat focus. Combat focus basically helps you with your score streaks. And um the armor is basically an armor for for the um, battery is basically an armor. So like when you pop your kinetic armor, you can you, they can only kill you. They'll have less chances of killing you. Only if they hit you in the head, they'll have a faster chance of killing you. Um, so I have the vision pulse. You can see like um, enemies behind walls and all of those stuff. They will um, they will um, be outlined in red. Number five, score streaks. In order for you to be able to use your score streaks, especially the hater, you have to be a really good player. You have to be able to get your score streaks. As you can see right there in the video, I'm running UAV, counter UAV, in the hater. The UAV so you can see your players because it's free for all. There are no pl other players to help you get your UAV. You got no teammates, right? Um, counter UAV to take out. Like if you're playing basically regular free for all, as I'm doing here, I mostly play hardcore free for all. But I usually play, I, I play free for all, regular free for all too. So yeah, counter UAV works best on both because you take out their, um, their UAVs. They can't see shit basically. And your hater, like you can't, if you if you have a hater and you choke on your, it's either, it's either if you get killed on your hater, you are trash, or you just basically had a choke. 
you just had a choke point because like if you have a hater you're basically unstoppable like you see every player movement it's not like a uav where it, where it blinks every how many seconds like the, the hater is up there for a while too so yeah and if you're a person who can't really get your score your your score streaks really you should use something like uav count on uav and something like i'm not sure just use a smaller score streak that may help guys Number five, we got the perks. Some really good, the top three perks, well, I won't give you guys my top three, but some of the best perks to use is, if, especially if you're a person who can't get your score streaks, use Anthe up. Sometimes I use it, but I don't really need it, but I just use it for the cause of it. I don't know why. I just love using it. Another um, good one to use is Six Sense. Six Sense is really valuable in freaking free for all. Six Sense, you have Ghost. Ghost is, a ghost is actually pretty good. You have Dead Silence. And for nukes, like if you want a nuke out or something, you can use um, s um Scavenger. If you want to go on high score streaks, use Scavenger so you won't be able to run out of um ammo. Guys, and this is basically it. If you guys want a part 2 to this, just tell me down in the comment section down below. 20 likes and you guys will get 20 likes and some comments. And you guys have a part two for yourselves. All right, it's been your boy Sun Sun. I'm out. I hope this tutorial helped you. Don't forget to like, subscribe if you're new. I'm out. Peace.